Hey everyone. Um, it's been 24 days today since I had my surgery. I've got probably another 20 days to go before I can start lifting weights. Uh, a few days ago, the 14th, so the, today's the 16th. Yeah, the 14th, I was told I'm able to lift more than 10 pounds, which I've pretty much already been doing that off and on, just so I can know I can not just jump right into it. Um, just don't tell my surgeon that. Oh, um, this was Dr. Kaufman, and I'm not sure if she's a nurse or not, but Andrea, she's a nurse, but more than a nurse, I guess. I don't know the ranks of it, but he did a really good job, and she's she's a really good nurse. Um, I don't know, let me flip it around so you can see better. For some reason, my phone's not letting me actually switch, hit the button and switch around. Um, the scars are healing really well. Um, still a little puffy right there, and on the sides, but they said that if dog ears do form and the swelling doesn't, it's not just swelling, if it doesn't go down, that they can fix that. It'll be an in and out process. Um, trying to crack my back, sorry. I can sometimes, but not always the way I need it to, not yet at least. So when I start to stretch, I can feel it like right here on both sides, <laughs> and it just won't let me stretch, which I get why, but um, my right nipple, I can't feel it yet. Like I can feel, I'm trying to figure out where I can feel, I can feel up here. I can't feel any of this. Well, I feel the pressure, but that's about it. Um, still a little itchy. <laughs> um, the nipple's doing really well. There's the scabs on it. They're, they're already falling off, um, but there's no signs of an issue with that nipple. Same with this one. This one I can actually feel just a tiny bit. I can. This side's really sensitive right here. Up here I can't feel. Not a lot. Not until I actually get up to here almost. Um, on my arms, like right here, there's like this whole area, I can't feel it. I can feel the pressure again, but same with that arm. Um, that's new from the first, since the first surgery. I, I don't know that feeling, or didn't know that that could happen, I guess I could say. <clears throat> um, but yeah, overall, I'm really happy about this. Um, it looks kind of bad when I put my arms up like that. and <laughs> it's You can see the... Uh, the sides but um, I'm happy I like the communication the fact that they actually do communicate and the fact that they said if there's a problem with the sides unlike the first surgeon who just kept saying oh you're swollen you'll be fine you'll be fine it's there's no problem not even the chance that there could be a problem so that helps that helps ease my anxiety and stuff um, yeah um, which I've had a lot of anxiety about this. Damn it. This tube hole really itches. I've been itching it a lot today. I should probably stop, but <laughs> I'm stubborn. Um, that tube hole's pretty much gone. It's like right in the crease where the uh, swollen part sits on, but that one doesn't bother me at all, which is odd because the first time it was my right side, not my left side, that bothered me. Um... My hair is finally starting to um, come back. You can see the line where they shaved me. And then you can finally see all that coming back. It really does grow fast. <laughs> uh, trying to think of anything else. Right here keeps itching, but I cannot feel that at all. So it's driving me nuts. Like I can rub right here and it just barely touches it. But it still doesn't do what I need it to do. Yeah. I have my, uh, as I was saying, it gets real tight right here if I pull up. But I can already stretch my arm all the way up to there, both of them. Um, it's when I try to pull my arm back instead of forward and up that I can feel the stretching. Right here is where it was stretching at first, but I think I'm kind of used to that now. 
because I, I I feel it, but I don't pay attention to it. Yeah. Hold on, get a little closer. Get a better shot. Damn. Itch won't go away, it's bugging me. <laughs> but yeah, um... I think I'm pretty much back to doing everything I normally do. Damn it. Can't keep it focused. There it goes. Um... I mean, I've been back to work since the week after I first got the surgery. It's all I could take time off of at work. It was my vacation. Uh, which, I mean, I guess I'm grateful for that, so. Um, trying to think. I don't think there's anything else I really need to say. Uh, I don't think so. All right. Um. I go back in, today's November 16th, I go back to the surgeon on February, March, no, February 18th at 8 in the morning, which is going to be fun because it's an hour and 15 minute drive to Cleveland. <laughs> so, um, yeah, but I'll let everybody know how it goes. I'm happy, finally, after four years. <laughs>